many people have experienced the pain of a wasp sting? Ouch. If you're one of those people who enjoys the outdoors, entertaining outside, and of course gardening in the late summer, it's good to be reminded that there are social wasps like yellow jackets that are present in the landscape. It's about this time that their nests can be home to hundreds of wasps that can be aggressive if you are anywhere near their nest and they feel like they are in danger. Yellow jackets are social wasps that often live underground in abandoned rodent burrows. They are often confused with ground nesting bees and sometimes cicada killers. Aside from being underground, they may also be found in buildings, in wall voids, any spaces that are available for them to form nests in in the early spring. If you see a hole with several flying insects coming and going repeatedly throughout the day, this is likely a yellow jacket nest. If you're not sure, it's best to take a short video from a safe distance and send that clip to your local extension office. Make note of the exact location and please avoid the area. If they are yellow jackets, you have three options. The first is that you can leave them alone and avoid that area until winter when the colony will eventually die off. The second option is contacting a professional pest control company that can get rid of the nest for you. And third, you can decide to treat yourself. If you choose the third option and want to treat yourself, remember safety first. This is a task you want to do at night when all the yellow jackets are in the nest and they are no longer active flying about. You want to make sure to wear proper protective gear. This can be as simple as long pants and long sleeves, but it's best to protect your head and neck and face. So if you have a bee hat or some kind of netting, that would be great, as well as some work gloves. Because it may be dark, you want to use red lighting. You can easily put cellophane over a flashlight or use a red headlamp. Whatever insecticide you are using, make sure you read and follow the label. Then safely treat the nest and leave the area. The last thing you want to do is come back the next day and check for activity. If there's still activity, repeat again that evening. Avoiding stings can be as simple as covering your food and beverages while eating outdoors, managing outdoor trash receptacles, and avoiding nests in the area. In times when yellow jacket nests are discovered in high traffic areas like front porches, eliminating them may be the best option.